Mienna has remained bedridden for most of her childhood. However, despite her illness, she has also dreamed of becoming an idol. Eventually, her opportunity comes in the form of the Seven Selection Project, a brutal series of competitions best known as the starting point of the legendary idol Akira Asume. Anxious but excited, Suzuna enters the preliminary round of Selection Project. Though her singing dazzles the judges and her fellow competitors, Suzuna is unfortunately overcome by her nerves and freezes up in the middle of her performance. She recovers quickly, but stumble is great enough that she loses the winning spot and is disqualified. Or so it seems until Sari Kujina, the girl Susanna lost to, announces that she plans to drop out of the selection project, believing Susanna is a more talented singer and therefore deserves the right to compete. Susanna is caught off guard by the decision, but promises Sierra that she will meet again as top idol. She prepares herself for the challenging obstacle that lies ahead. This anime has about 13 episodes, premiere October 1st to December 24th of 2021, based off mixed media themes or idols and music. Each episode is 20 minutes and is rated PG-13. Let's get started into the review. We are back again with another anime review. Here we have the anime The Selection Project. Now every other anime idol seems to follow the same note, song and dance basically, but this one's different. In a case where our main protagonist, you know, is, you know, it's already music that gets the talent, but this is the case where we have Susanna, where she has an illness that has been stricken her during her weak heart condition. And then we'll dive more into that later, but she's always wanted to sing, but couldn't do that to the physicality of her body, which I get it, you know, every, there is always a stumbling block in a main protagonist, you know, backstory, which is fine. And, you know, I feel like this is a good way to tackle, like, this type of issue when you're like, oh, all the idols and every idol in are extremely healthy, happy, you know, and somewhat of a good home life, depending on the character or the side character. But in this case, we are thoroughly thrown into her backstory where, it's, hey, she has a weak heart. And, you know, then we see her a couple of years later where she's able to compete in this selection process of becoming an idol through this program that they have where she lives at. And this girl she meets here, right here, the blonde haired girl, you know, she sings against her and loses. But in turn of events, she's like, nah. She's like, she recognizes Susan's talent and she should be able to compete. And she goes off to do her own thing. But they vow to meet again as idols, as top idols at that. Which I thought was a cute, like, motivator for Susanna. You know, and now she has to, like, prove herself to her first rival in this instance that she could be a, a top idol just like her. Which I thought was very fascinating. And then you have the other side characters in this group who are all competing to be the next idol. And I feel like Suja on her condition, having a weak heart, you know, when we fast forward seeing her strong and healthy, we're like, how did she get so healthy so quickly? And I think that's also died on another thing of like, you know, death and loss and grief, which is a good way to segue into an idol anime, was sometimes always be happy go lucky, where it can be rift between different friendships along with the group, you know, they're struggling with like, you know, trying to be the best, trying to have good friendship. But I feel like what I really like about this one and other idol animes, it does show the similarity, you know, this isn't like a completely new anime. It's still similar from all the other idol animes. But when you, if you are a fan of the idol genre, if you love local characters, emotional stories, great performances, you know, what's not to love? And I feel like for this one, the selection project, I feel like this one just adds on to the list of idol anime, which, you know, you're getting that driven backstory, all the character development and the emotional story that ties along with it, along with all these characters from different aspects and prefectures from Japan. That's what I really like about the selection project. But definitely give this anime a shot if you love the idol genre theme and the music and everything else in this anime, which I thoroughly love a lot i really enjoy like you know the music the performances and the emotional ties when they're not singing or performing on stage to compete with each other but just also seeing how two people in this anime who are not telling who are connected more on a stronger level than we'll ever know but definitely check out structure uh project if you haven't already i give this anime a 7.9 out of 10 and i can't wait to see any more new drama idol anime that comes soon in the near future Go check it out and let me know what you think. I'll see you soon for another anime review. Until then, bye.